Hey, you want to answer my Okay, let's, let's look quickly. One thing our, our thoughts are about certain things, you know, is being a movement. And let's just spend a little time with how T or energy might move. Okay, for example, it goes up, but then it also goes down. One. Now I'm talking that, but yeah, that's what it starts that way. But if the flow up, there must be a flow back down. Okay. This one. There's an opening flow, but it comes back to the center. Opening flow comes back to the center. Now we're doing movement because we just think about it knowing, but yeah. And from the center, it goes back out, comes back to itself. So sometimes these are done as kind of like breath exercises, which is good. But how does energy move? Well, you have a yin and a yang, the fire and the water, the heaven and the earth. So you start out in heaven, goes back to earth, doesn't it? Earth goes back to heaven, doesn't it? Okay, water. Fire, water, fire. Yeah. Goes one way, goes back the other way. Between those two, goes out, comes back to the center, goes out the other way, comes back to the center. So it's kind of the movement of uh, what you call T, how, how T would move. Okay. There's a man, uh, Koichi Garish, he did a video once. And what he was saying, I try not to think, but when I think, I think about how key moves. It's supposed to how to do the movement, okay? Because when I'm trying to do the movement out there, I disconnect from myself, but I also disconnect maybe from how key might move, okay? So it expands, but it comes back to itself, goes back to the center, it expands, okay? Oh. There's always a balance. As much as it goes out, that much comes back. All right. From here, you go out in this direction, come back to itself. They're both going on. And they're both going on without fighting one another. Okay. And that way, the movement of T is, is kind of infinite. You can have this, and you can have this, and they don't collide. So it's very fluid, okay? And all of that's movement. But before there was movement, there was some form of stillness. Motion goes back to stillness, comes back to stillness. Movement, stillness, Stillness back to itself. Hmm. Yeah. Too busy out there to pick that up. Okay, good. And before our legs go, let's just kind of huh? basic warm up. Okay, whatever goes back has to come back forward. Simple motion. We just be warming up with a back roll, but okay. put the other foot forward if you haven't. The natural movement back, natural movement forward. Whatever goes back, wants to come back forward. Oh, good. And all that motion goes back to stillness, doesn't it? I mean, there's movement going on. But still, still, oh, I can't do it. Still enough. Let's check your system. In breath, goes to out breath. Out breath comes back as an in breath. Natural system. 
Everything kind of works for one going back to itself and doing that three to two. Yin yang, fire water. <sighs> so breathing a bit. Yeah. In breath. Goes back out. Out breath. Comes back in. Very natural system. So most of the time we're busy out there trying to do something. And so we're just taking a second to do to kind of inspire how to move. Okay. Out breath, in breath. Natural systems like tied in, tied out. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And one other thing here, whatever goes out, puts back on itself. It went out, it has to come back. In fact, I'm trying to come back, but I haven't gone out for you. Okay. And right here we say the chapter effect. Huh? So this is kind of like a, a laser pistol. I want to shoot myself in the belly. So part of that is. Huh? Huh? Goes out, comes back. Goes out, good, comes back. Okay, so let's uh, start with a partner. Okay. Oh, a little fuller on the out. Okay. So for example, here, I'm wanting to kind of push out. Now, if you're really solid on me, I still have to go out to come back. Okay. Yeah. But I'm too caught up in that. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I don't know where he is right now. This is about us from being confused. Yeah, this is my worry is basketball. Well, you guys may have gotten that bad overnight. It's just kind of between here and there. Okay. Uh, uh, mm. Is it that quick? Probably. <laughs> they don't work really hard to be this bad. <laughs> you see what I mean? So stop working. Right. So extend offer. Let's to go out before it comes back. You see that feeling right there? Yeah. Let's go out before it comes back. It's very natural system. Moving the key is very natural. Yeah. So now, one of the things right there. Part of that, that includes some depth. That's the top there. Okay, I did the physical act. You did very well. Tied in, tied out. This is a deep ocean, isn't it? All the energy is collecting my shoulder. Now, now the key in my own system has to be smooth. Okay. So I think the advantage of moving the key. Fire, water. Fire, water. My system has to relax, but it's a dip factor to the water. Oh. Okay. Okay. What did I do? Clear. I'm too caught up in doing that. No, it's clear. Okay, I'm just caught in that, that the crazy of the world. Yes, there's a lot of important stuff going on. And I have my center. Okay, go. Four. I'm shrinking before I pass. Okay, bring it on. 
Yeah. Bring it on, no such feeling. Bring it on. Better? Oh, pull it. Bring it on, bring it on, bring it on, yes. And you're more natural, the thing is smoother. Okay. I think I'd like to, you know, bring out it. Bring out mm -hmm. yeah. I'd like to get this project off the ground. Okay. Well. I've got my plan, let's execute that plan. Huh? We're supposed to, I'd like to get it off. That's already oh. off the ground. See that feeling? A lot of the problem is me. I gotta get out of my own way. And let the yin and the yang of things, the yin and the yang of sea, fire, water, heaven, earth, where do you want to So go. That's better. And it's still coming up. Yeah, that's better. That is better. But the other thing is, whatever goes up comes down. Whatever goes up, it's part of my offering again. There's no thing. It comes down. Well, natural movement. What in the series of natural movement? Ah, okay. Yeah. Okay. So take it down as a key. And you sort of get how it works. Then simplify. That's better. Then deeper. The deep is your ocean, pretty deep. Okay, all right. Okay, now it's important right here. Whatever goes out, comes back. We're trying to come back without fully going out. Oh, okay, good. We don't want to get caught out there. It's hard. Trust the movement of peace. Goes out, has to come back. Breathe out, you have to breathe in. It's natural movement. So offer, got to go out. Yeah, now slowly, you so you're already thinking about coming back. Go out. And then to that, yes. Yeah. <laughs> Begin in the end, right? Begin in the end. Don't go, don't stop. Don't try to come back and never go out. Right? I mean, problem with the pandemic. Like, okay, we can't go anywhere. Well, there's a bit more freedom now. Now we can have people get intelligently. Right? No, I can't. Okay. Huh. So I'm trying to go. Come on. Come on. <laughs> you know, taking precautions, vaccination, boosters. I mean, this stuff, we got to, you know, okay. So go, go out. But you can also come back. Yes. Yes. And when you do that, you're harmonizing with something more than just your own key. Yeah. You see what I mean? And you know, I, I mean, I keep, I sense to say that I feel it's not a religion, but it's practical. Okay. If I'm, I have so much self doubt that nothing gets off the ground. Well, okay. <laughs> yeah. You see? Yeah. So that area, extend out. Extend out. It'll naturally come back. Yes. It slows, doesn't it? What did you do? You just got out of your own way. Okay. You see? Yeah, okay. Well, okay. Yeah. I can't blame him, but you're tying yourself to not. Got it? Good. 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 It's working, but you're telling yourself enough. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Not right there. I just wanted to show how deep it is. Okay. Uh, the rules of the keys, for example, is very fluid with it. So well, I do. I got to get out of my own way. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So go. Come on. Stand out. Get out of your own way. Come on. Freer, freer, freer.
but you're still letting him tie you up. So he's not tying you up, you're tying yourself up. What deep is your option? Your own personal option. What deep is it? Got it? Oh, boom. What am I doing? I'm just trying to get out of my own way. I'm trying to look at you and I'm trying to figure out how to do it. Boom, boom. Where do I go? We're all capable of doing so much more than we give ourselves permission to do. Okay? Huh? Okay, now, what are those doors that swing freely? This is a little rusty here. Boom. It swings freely. Free motion. Free motion. Good. Yeah. Because the only person that, that, that the, the only limiting factor is who we think we are in the moment. Yeah, I mean, there are other limitations, okay? But, Okay, you kind of know it because you it, it flows. You know what I mean? Yeah. You're much more powerful without having to kind of work because you've got the tight in, tight out moving with you. You see what I mean? You got the movement of feet, you know, filling your movement. That's a pretty good thing. Yeah, okay. 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 Oh. So I was kind of mentioning whatever goes up comes down. So for example, if I start going this way, I have a physical limitation this way. Okay? Well, I'm going this way. The circle has to come back to the center, doesn't it? The NPM, fire the water. I'm going to go this way. Oh, I'm saying, you know, it's a circle, it has to come back to the center, doesn't it? That's another pattern right, left, up, down, front, back. The archetypal pattern center to circle, circle to center. Okay, in other words, here. Okay, okay. the movement now looks like a circle, but it comes back to the center, so it can circle around a little bit more. Okay, sometimes we, if we really, if you're going to think, which we all are going to think, okay, how does, how does energy move? Well, it moves right, wherever it goes right has to come back left. Okay? Whatever goes down has to come back up, doesn't it? And you see the movement as waves, spirals, energy flows. Okay? The third factor, okay, so you know, turn in the circle, right to left, up to down, whatever, is I. Here's how the eye is getting caught up here. Mm -hmm. That's what it, we're not just gotta come back. Instead of holding myself, put it down here. So when what I'm saying is that when you start to think about how energy moves, the eye starts to clear out theoretically. In practice, okay. Huh? You have your own system. Energy is in my system, but also energy out there is too. So what happens if the eye gets in there, it freezes me in my own system. So I'm just saying, okay, it's very easy to are. Easy. 
Oh my god, wait, I can hear him. Oh my god, I can hear him. Well, this system is moving my hands in and out, but the movement of energy, anything that comes in, you don't have to stand that out for itself. Okay? It's just a system. Now, if it's mental, okay, I know that. Well, and what happens when I'm in that state, his energy, my energy, create a harmony between us. So my eye is trying to figure it out. The whole thing with the Ukrainian situation is the guy in Russia is crazy. You cannot deal with insanity, <laughs> although we're trying to, okay? Insanity is insanity. What do we do? We proceed very carefully insanity tends to come back on itself. Question is, what else does it bring in? But we gotta be very careful there. Okay. Yeah. It goes out before it comes back. Okay, now it comes back, it goes out again. It just took a little bit. Okay. Oh, we're down here. <laughs> fluid system, when I get out of the way and understand how energy or sea or whatever spirit or sense it call me. Uh -oh. I like that word. Okay, so a little bit of sweaty was in fact, this will be some rolling on the ground just to kind of warm up. Okay, all right. Different partner. Spread out. Oh boy. Yeah, yeah. Oh, careful of the scoop, okay? The scoop, the scoop. That's when I'm standing and I try to move again and again, I get little results. Yeah. It's raining, I stick my hand out for the collect here. Or conversely, oh, there's this, I need water. There's a lake. But you don't want to get caught up high and dry here in that moment. Just go down, think that. Try it again. Three. Yes. What gets in the way is I. I want to form this because I'm used to limited situations. Okay. What if? So what if the Warriors win the next 15 games? It's possible. How likely is it? I don't know. But but you know, Curry calls it infinite thinking. He calls it infinite thinking. So much more likely to succeed when you are in an open, clear state, then when you're letting circumstances kind of bind you. Let's play last night, but I fought him a shot 17 times. I'm glad he did. I just wish half of him had gone on. Okay, good, 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 good. Okay. So do you the scoop? It does form that shape. It goes out, comes back. Goes out, it collects from the back. There's a natural speaking motion, but I don't want to do that. Under pressure, I go this way and get limited results as opposed to. Well, right. uh, we want to, in some sense, be conscious of a limited eye and its limited solution. Right. 
Okay. I'm Steve Kerr. I started all with the liner. I can't do that, but you might as well. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yes. 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 What does the limited solution mean? It means I'm trapped in a limited sense of who I am. Okay. Well, it's ridiculous. It goes out, it has to come down. Huh? It goes up, it has to come down. To take a second or two, what happens? The eye becomes clear. How do you see me? And since they say, you, you didn't use the you were with his eyes too, though, but you like the word common, fire water. Water collects, but it goes out, illuminates everything, it's fire, boom. Comes back to itself to rain. Then, so we're part of a cycle of everything in nature. It's just all we get too used to the eye being very limiting. You know? Limited solutions, you know? I could be here, I could be dribbling a basketball. I mean, you know, I mean, it's not the same thing. So it's the same thing. Whatever goes down has to come back up, right? Clear. The eye has to be very easy with itself. It goes out. <laughs> Thank you, Lynch. I don't know if I can get it. I don't know if I can get it. I don't know if I can get it. We're in this nice little pool. It's very loving here. He's having a great time in this water bath. Okay? All right? All right? Wait, wait, wait. But you still here. You don't want to get out. He wants to go back in. Okay, good. And then, you know, the, the thought of martial arts is war or something, so that's outmoded. Uh, now, if, if, if all of a sudden the whole world could do that, you know, if, if Russia and the Ukraine could kind of come together this way, wouldn't that be a beautiful world? Yeah, so we have issues here because, you know, we get caught up in this and that and this and that. Okay. Whatever just think it expands back out, doesn't it? If it comes in tight, if it comes in tight, okay, it has to go back out. And it expands his way. But the tighter it is, the more room it just happens to you know it's like the little bit of the little bit of is very free. Very free. It's very free. Well, it comes in, it just goes up, but it comes back down, doesn't it? And then the world goes, the world goes back up. And a little bit of what we call fucking mercy happens, right? And so it's me. And then back to that limited self and limited solution. Okay. I'm trying to do. Is let the eye be very easy with itself, go to a, a transparent place with itself. Come on. This is what we all have done. Doesn't interfere with the movement of peace. 
Krishna? Huh? Okay. Oh, hey. Stand up for a second. Ah. See, one of the things about a sensei's philosophy is this very advanced. And he talks, you know, in code sort of. Okay. The Dodo Sensei is saying that basically what he was was an alchemist. And part of the alchemy code is that you don't say things like dot, dot, dot. You put code words out. And then, you know, the, 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 the adepts have to somehow figure out the code. You can't give something to somebody. Uh, the Dodo Sensei is fond of the story where Sensei calls him in and says, you know, what I do is very easy. Very easy. It's so easy, I can't give it to you. It's easier than you can imagine, and I can't give it to you. Okay, which obviously stuck with me, though, since I thought of it. It's so easy. Okay, so one of the things, for example, uh, if we, you know, just stand up and stretch the legs for a bit, okay, it goes out, it has to come back. It goes, huh? It comes in, okay, it has to go back out. Okay, it stops, it has to start up again. Okay. And so, you know, what you're saying is that the original sense of things, it was an original true beingness to everything. But it didn't do anything. So, you know, it's either too still or, you know, it's not chaos, but it's kind of like, okay. And so it had to kind of yin yang itself to start things moving. So here we are. We we're part of that original thing, you know, the original yin yang. So, you know, what a key, if you can understand the movement of key, it's yin yang, fire, water. Okay. Now, the other way of putting it is receptive positive. Okay. Now he's going to come down. And his power is containing my power. Okay, so what, what do I need to do? My power must step aside and let the yin in. And then yin amplifies my power. The yin and the yang of things are not supposed to fight. Ukrainians, Russians, are not supposed to do this. NATO, Russia, we're not supposed to do this. Why are we doing this? It's the world of I. Ah, so Osente was talking about Take Mishi. Take is an old reading of Marshall. But Marshall itself, Bu, Take, old reading of Bu, is not about aggression, it's about stopping the spear. Not spearing something. And it has the sense where stop, you know, two spears, right? One spear, what are you going to do? Nothing. There's another spear, stop that. Now the other one, Musu, is, is really, um, it's, it's the same thing as Umu, which is to give birth. So you saw the techniques, for example, the original meaning of Marshall or Bu, Udo, right? was to stop the spear. And then he tied it with Yusu, which is an older reading of giving birth to. To give birth to the marshal that stops the conflict. And what does that mean? It's going to be movement. It's just all of a sudden we go back to the original harmony that everything was intended to be. Okay? So when you when, when read the term Taki Mushu, that, you know, it's very deep. Taki Mushu, no. And, you know, he was really talking about, you know, giving birth to it, which so it's not an idea. In fact, what he did say, he said, women have a better sense of it than men because we're, we're out there trying to win. And, you know, uh, the whole act of giving birth is a very dynamic thing. 
that's present in my daughter's birth, the home birth. And uh, I was going, wow. The act of giving birth is incredibly powerful. And you give birth through yourself. Now, one thing we're saying a little bit, for example, with those doubts, has to come back, push back on it. Clearing out I. Huh? His power is negating my power. So we're going to have a war here. Uh, yeah. So what did I do right there? I shifted from my power yang being well, yang state. Oh, okay. So what happened is I didn't win, the system went into balance. Now the system includes not just me and my movement, but, but my partner's movement. I won, not really. Energy collapse, yeah, energy goes back on itself. I'm part of that movement. He's part of that movement. Okay. And so, you know, it's martial arts, so it looks like a throw, looks like I won. But you know, the whole thing right here. It's something very different. Huh? But the more I get caught up in the game, the more I get away from what Ochensei called Takemusu because it's about winning. So he used the term. Ogatsu, Masaka, true victory is winning over myself. What does that mean? Instead of getting caught up in these stereotypes, I try to find kind of that transparency in myself that allows this harmony to exist. So, you know, his Japanese term for that was Misogi. You know, the eye wants to either make war. We want everything to be peace so we don't have to do anything. And peace is a very dynamic state. All right? So, you know, if you go, okay, finally there's peace. Kabang! <laughs> but conversely, we're just too busy fighting to get any sort of balance or harmony going. So we created Takemusu Aichi as a, as a type of lesson for us. Okay? All right? With me on that one? So we're walking this path together from two different perspectives. I understand that he's a circle, but there's a harmony, isn't there? Center and circle don't fight each other. But the center is a little bit more like the yang and the circle is a little bit more like the yang, but they don't fight. In uke nage, what we're doing is we're reenacting in a martial sense, but it's really much more than just martial. It goes back to those senses reading of martial. Two spears stop the conflict. Give birth to something that is giving birth is creation. What are we giving birth to? A clear eye that's more transparent that allows the original yin yang of the movement to work in its team. Then what we're doing is what the world obviously needs right now, <laughs> which is the harmony. Okay. Or some say sense of peace is more like a dynamic harmony where two forces flow together. War. Indifference, separation, no, they interact. They move together. There's a dynamic sense when I can clear enough to get out of the way and allow that original harmony. And so his lesson, to be honest with you, all right, because we're, we're kind of having discussions about, you know, eventually, hopefully, the, the Third Street location comes up, right? And, you know, I do pretty much daily prayers. And I kind of, I know I'm overstating it, but it's the Hobo Dojo West. Think big, <laughs> right? No, no, we'll have a dojo in San Jose that's the, uh, it's gonna be a good school. No, we're gonna be the Hobo Dojo West. Now I might get excommunicated for that, but 
you know. My sense is there'll be a place where people can come together to learn to stop the spear, be involved in clearing out the fearful, angry eye, and allowing the energies of the universe as they were originally intended to be, to be harmoniously expressed. That's the IT. We got to learn how to get out of our own way. Okay. Natural movement. Whatever goes out has to come back. Whatever has to come back goes out. Whatever goes down has to come back up. To go back down. That's how key moves. And we're enacting, as much as it's a wonderful situation, we're enacting both he and I, clearing the eye out and allowing that natural sense of movement that is connected to both you and your partner. We're reenacting either all the problems of the world or we're enacting something that's a solution to the world's problems. That's 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 the talk that Musu IQ was was talking about. Okay? So standing, there's going out, now it comes back. Joe's going down now. Now I want to go headlong and crash into him because that, that's my stupid sense of what Yang is, but in here. But when down comes out, and there it goes back. This quick motion, boom. Okay, so let's stand, change partners, who went to the coquine all day. I think I kind of want you to look at it a bit. Whatever goes out has to come down. Okay. Now here, what I'm doing is I'm getting caught up in a limited solution. What's your own? Right? What was that? What went out? It comes back, doesn't it? It's two very harmonious forces. So what am I doing? I'm just trying to get out of my own way because I'm going to try to do it out there. It goes out, it comes back. Well, it goes down, it comes back up, doesn't it? It comes back up, it goes back down. That's, so, you know, for thinking at all, we're thinking about the movement of chi that you have to look at in a yin yang. Chi moves. Okay, doesn't do much for me. But you know, when you see the movement, you're going to see half of it, but you're going to see the flow of the, that half to the other half and back and back and back. And you get an up, down, you get a front, back, you get an in, out, you know, more advanced, you know, like right here, for example. All right. This is a circle going back to the center, which goes back to the circle. It goes the other way, too. You grab me out there. Okay. Okay, now this is the circle must come back to the center. And now it goes. So, you know, it's not such thing with center circle, fire water. Okay, but you see the same thing here. Okay, so most of the time, Aikido is not taught that way. Uh, it's not so not with it. And then you have to learn where the feet move and stuff like that. But to get the overriding sense right here, what are you going to do? It's a limited solution. What else got to come back? And so, you know, what we're really doing is getting out of the way, and we have key in our own system, but there's a universe of key, right? And so, you know, at some point we're syncing up with that. So we can just go along this way, and we can go that way. Right? Right here, for example, so, okay, the circle now goes back to the center of right? okay. So, you know, in a sense, it's not cerebral thinking. It's more like feel, imagine. You just say, okay, how does feel move? All right, what do I have to do? 
But I can't just think about it. I got to get on my own way to allow the images to move. Okay. And, and then I think they kind of found, you know, at the beginning of whatever, it's created to be an absolute harmony. Peace is an illusion. Really what we want is harmony. And what happens there is I try to run it. We want the eye to be in balance. You know, I don't want to make my eye too strong. Uh, so, you know, I don't want to deal with stuff out of the way. Well, that's the energy of things. Mm. I want the eye to be as transparent as I can, you know, which means I just got to be very, very easy with the movement, easy with myself, easy with my partner. Just trying to find out, you know, then it's a, then it's not the moose, right? I, I was present when my daughter was born, and it was like, okay, you know, her mom was in labor for an incredible amount of time, you know, and uh, we took all these Lamar's classes and then didn't practice. <laughs> you know, it's just like, you know, okay, we know what we're supposed to do. Okay, but we didn't practice. But it worked out. The, 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 the raw power of the act of giving first. What was I going to do? I thought of when she came out. Jared did all the Me, I, you know, don't feel a lot. You know. But, okay, there she is. Yeah. Right? And so, you know, the, the six is what is that? So even though I was on the outside, still a lot of interior and how to calm that, clear that. Because when this is too disparate, then this is crazy. And just, you know, kind of see both people. We look at how things just naturally come together. But since they kind of found, I mean, at the beginning, the end didn't start with the end, or vice versa. We were in perfect accord. And then as things evolve, we get all the separation, the polarization, so now the world from there. But the IT, though, I mean, you know, in a sense, you know, you're, okay, well, it's, it's ambitious to say we're going to. You know, hopefully don't go west, but you have to have an understanding of what Ocente was talking about when he's talking about what I do today, right? And so, you know, we're not going to be world headquarters in Tokyo, but, you know, we try to pass this on, right? Okay, anyway. <laughs> ah. Okay, now, one of the things right here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I hit a wall. I'm going to climb the wall to the other side. Okay. I'm going to hit a wall. So I'm just going to climb the wall. Okay. See, what happens is whatever comes in has to go back out. Okay, okay now we're proud of it, but it has to go back out, doesn't it? If you follow the yin yang pattern, then. if you say T, it's an idea. How does T operate? It operates to yin yang, fire, water, in a circle. Okay. Too tight in the center? It's a circle. You don't waste a lot of time trying to fight to see the center stronger. You see what I mean? By law, so you and I represent center, circle, circle, the center. It's an original harmony. Okay. The center may be more yang, the circle's a bit more yang. Okay. And that's even making it more than it is. It's just a very fluid process. But when you come in this way, oh, good. See, your center and my center can fight here, or the circle. The collective center can go to the collective circle. You see? So, you know, um, now I got to escalate. You see what I mean? Yeah. Boy, are we both stupid. We're threatening to take over a country and we have to kind of 
throw these sanctions and create all these things. Why don't we just get along? Why don't you stay where you are, make friends with your, your brothers in the Ukraine, and you know we'll, we'll be NATO and we'll we'll all get along. And this will be a paradise. You can turn our attention to the environment, and everybody wins. Isn't that stupid? You know, of course, you know, we got to, we, we have our act to play, you know, and we just got to, you know, on the other hand, if you kind of look at, you know, with, with the design of creation, it's for everybody to prosper. Right? I can't do that. NATO's right on my border. I'm going to get the Ukraine to buffer that. Ukraine may join NATO, and then I'm really screwed. Yeah, okay. Yeah, but we could do so much more, you know. Yeah, let me, let me, let me, okay. Now, what I want you to do, this is Senator to Senator, and his Senator is taller than mine. You go to the circle. This is Senator to Senator, and yours is lower than mine. The circle. You gotta shift dimension sometimes because when we go Senator to Senator, all we do is uh, create more tension, and we get limited solutions. Huh. It'd be nice to say, okay, no, no more fighting. <laughs> Wouldn't that be nice? But then again, the eye creates conflict in this limited space. So we gotta, you know, since they were saying, he's too winning, it's winning over yourself. You can't, there'll be more out there as long as the eye is. is Underdeveloped as it is, it's really yourself. Okay, so if you're here, okay, it went out, it's just fast, did not it? The perfect harmony. Hmm? Now the center goes out to the circle, the circle returns to the center. So we have a darn good pattern. You see what I mean? Yes. And then we're doing a little bit, you know, our version of what I think they might have meant by talking these two. So go again, he's tall. Okay, you're gonna run your center's gonna run into the height. Now the circle comes in. The circle comes in. Yes. You have to be aware that if, you, if you're gonna think, think of how T moves. Okay, in other words, if the center the center opposition, you shift to the circle. You see the feeling right there? You need both. The circle goes back to the center. The center goes back to the circle. As you're coming in, this way, center, the circle. And then this way, center, the circle. There's an easy harmony, isn't it? And there's a, there's a harmony in the Peace. Peace doesn't exist. It's just an idea in my mind, so I don't have to worry about anything. All right, so I'm going to Okay. Well, it looks like I'm winning, but we are in that pattern. Your circle to my center, my center to your circle are, are, are really talking. We have a dynamic exercise, so we, it's not just a mental exercise. You see what I mean? You have to win win. But since it created this whole world way right behind it, that's kind of like, you know, the, the, the thing about, you know, the docent and I had a session yesterday about, you know, the, the property on Third Street. And I've been praying, it's going to be the home, I don't know why, but it's the home of Dojo West. And, you know, the consensus is, okay, now, mix it. It's a great idea. So mix it. Huh? Great idea, now mix it. See it. <laughs> That's the challenge, isn't it? The right for you when you're dealing with that, like for example, here, you said it's lower than mine. What do I do? I'm going to get lower than you. Okay. You see how that center the circle, that center, center, center. There's always some permutation of that. More basic, it's there. But then the, the gradations of it is more complex. There's still two forces. Well, we go again. So that's better. Yeah. So you didn't get stronger. You didn't wipe them out. You just now, there, you're a little quick. 
That's it. That's it. Now, circle. The thinking center to center. Right? And the problem with that is that then it becomes a competition center to center. Well, he wants to be center. He prides. Okay, we, we, we become the circle. Now, you know, the other thing is, okay, I'm going to circle. No. Boom. That's the tricky one. There's a transparency as I like it. You see what I mean? I, I realize that, well, I'm creating a lot of the problems here by being a limited eye. Okay. Yeah. Like yeah. You get in the way. Well, so we all, yeah, and we all do. We all do. That, that's one of the reasons I think we created this thing. It's so we get a better sense of how this is a beautiful idea and a limited eye doesn't go anywhere. Right? <laughs> yeah, I mean, it just doesn't. I mean, oh, it's a beautiful idea. Well, screw you, you know? So, you know, there's, there's a lot of, I say, work there, but it's not just work out there. It's like that interior. Right? Okay? All right. Okay. So whatever the movement happens to be a little bit like this. Okay, because I mean yeah. whatever the movement happens to be. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna go forward. I'm just gonna go forward on a flash right here. I go forward, but I it's gonna be forward to turn to back. Yeah, what do I do here? Well, back turns into forward. So oh, I went down. Okay, now gotta go back up. I went back, now go forward here. Okay. So, you know, just in that basic movement, we're working several changes of key shifting from this to that, that, that to this, okay? When we do that, I mean, what, in a sense, you can't just be thinking about it up here, but it gets us out of the limited eye in this limited solution. Well, so something in this okay. Four. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Or, okay, it's going to come back down, doesn't it? I jumped in there. Oh, okay, this ground. And so, you know, one way of looking at it, we tend to look at it as form, but if we we're also there's all of a sudden our consciousness of being, how does K move? According to you know yin to yang yang to yin and harmony, yin they don't fight. Okay. Uh, uh, whatever the movement happens to be. Uh, whatever the movement happens to be. Uh, When I get out of my eye, I don't do this to do that. Right? Anyway, so keep going with what you're doing, okay? So the other thing right there, the one you get the other one, just this one. This will be too visual. Okay. See the whole room. You see the whole room. Okay. You Russian, I'm Ukrainian. Right now that's not okay. We're all part of the world. 
Okay, but one of the things right there is right there, see the whole room. You see her, of course, if you, if you see the whole room, you see, you see her. Yeah, see that motion right there? But, you know, he can teach you some things to yell at people and he say, never look at the attacker. What are you doing? You see, the, you can't not see the attacker. If you do, you know, you see the whole room, soft eyes. Okay. So one of the things. So you're looking over there, there's a whole bunch of junk going on in the other part of your classroom. You have to say, okay, I gotta monitor that. So you can't let the class go out of control this way. See that's getting a little bit. I don't know if I'm saying that. Yeah. Um, I know I karate for a short time. Yeah. Yeah. Whereas here it's like more fuzzy. Well, the way that I think they put it. Now it's a contest. Okay. I can not scare you. Okay. Yeah. Now, the, the thing right there, even in Karate, is that, you know, um, look over there, see me. Okay. Now look at me. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go this way, raise your hand. Okay. Now, see her, see me, raise your hand. That's faster. You know who taught me that? Velvet Koga. If you're a police officer, you, you, you've got a, you know, you see a couple of people and all of a sudden it's like, you know, there's somebody else going to pull down. And you can go, and then it's a towel. You know, you gotta, watch where your hands are. Watch what you do with your hands right now. But I'm going to show it just the issue. And also have a, a chance where there might be somebody coming up behind you. It's just feel fast. Okay. You see, the, the karate is all based on. Now, I'm going to freak you out in here. You see? Yeah. Now, yeah, see her. You have a better sense of, of me, don't you? Your reaction time is faster when you're not. Right. Yeah. Back then, my, my, my original karate style is Shotokan, which is like. And a little bit, you know, move to the side, but it's all like on the train and you're on the track. You know, I want to keep you going back and then, right? That was it, you know. So, uh, yeah, the, the karate stuff, it's interesting. Look, look, look at her. Now, I'm going to move towards you. You'll pick me up much faster with what you call the soft eyes. The way that Koga sent you for a wide angle lens. Okay. Yeah. See, what is spirit? She grabs me, and then my spirit gets so small. See the room? Huh? See right here, for example. I'm going to step to the side so that you can't hit me, but you're just going to hit me anyway. So it's here. So when he can do this, I said, you know, I think they said, don't look in your turn at the eyes. What he meant, I would say, is not turn your head away from your opponent, but you see kind of more of a collective. That's spirit. Right. The right angle works. When I start looking at it this way, we're subject object. And then here, we're, we're kind of in the same room. So that, that's a much larger spirit than you not the tunnel vision, right? I do this, I get a headache. Uh, does that make any sense? Okay. Uh, Thank you. Okay. Okay. Yeah, one of the other things that we're kind of stressing a bit is uh, the sensei said stuff like don't look in your opponent's eyes. 
And I think his largest sense was when you do that, you create an opponent. And in a sense, what he was also saying with Captain Rishi is if you create an opponent in IC terms, you already lose. That's a tricky one. But you know, for us, for example, just for a second, see the whole room. Be conscious of who's on your right, your left. Don't tune me out <laughs> or zone out. You can pay attention to me and see the whole room. And when you do that, you're, you're tuning into something which we might call other names for it, spirit. What is spirit? Spirit is the stage that yin and yang are fire and water. Can interact in IC terms. It's expansive. It's inclusive. And you're definitely there. You can go this way and drift. It's not spirit. You're in the moment, moment by moment, calm. Settle. And what happens when that's there? The eye has become extremely transparent. You can't, with the eye too busy, be there. And the first thing that happens is somebody grabs your wrist, all of a sudden you go tunnel vision. Or conversely, you hear that, you hear the words, you drift. Okay? So if you dressed in a tough martial arts school, they kick your butt, all right? <laughs> but if you're too small in a martial arts, you're, you're, you're fodder for somebody to kick your butt. We're, we're not into kicking people's butts. We kind of inch, you kind of everybody kind of understanding, you know, various laws of harmony. It starts with I, when the eye quiets down, it gets transparent. You set the stage, turn the stage for Yen and Yang to do their dance. Too compact. This is like a beautiful couple, all of a sudden they can't get along with each other. <laughs> you know, that does happen, let me tell you. All right. I didn't know you were this when we got together. Well, I didn't know you were that. So no, 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 no. we gotta take easy here. We're just getting to know each other a little better. Okay. My partner is battling cancer, and a, a response that I've learned. Oh, you're getting angry. You must be getting better. Your energy is coming out. <laughs> and I forget a lot. You know, and you know, the worst thing for me to do is to uh, get angry back, you know, which, which does happen, unfortunately. But if I could be a little more transparent, you see, oh yeah. That's good. That's absolutely good. Now I just need to be easier, let you, you know, not take it personally, and then you can kind of you you won't stay in me. <laughs> Okay, just get your energies coming out. Okay, so you know, just uh, uh, it's interpersonal or you know, societal or global or whatever. And since they thought in universal terms, and there are various stages of spirit, it's real difficult to do this on the global level right now. Just this. But I think his wish for the world was for IT and the Taki Risa form to take the root here. So, one of the things about you know, the uh, dirt tree property, when I, you know, I, you know, I started doing this thinking, you know, I'm starting to think too much like Kiki Kiki Sensei. You know, so, no, it's the Homer Dozo West. 
Does that mean we're going to, we're going to have 400 students and we're up to concrete building? No. But we can start to maybe teach the Takumusu. Okay. Teach the win over yourself, which means the I becomes more transparent with itself, more of an I self to self. You can start to appreciate how opposites, fire and water, yin and yang, up and down, front and back, out, victory, defeat, even. They work as a team. Or we become, everybody then becomes a teammate. And then we have a, you know, to quote, sports, we have a strength in numbers, which is, I think, what I was going to say. One, he didn't want everybody doing Aikido and throwing people on the world in chaos. He wanted, you know, the Aikido to, to be an agent of Takumisu where everybody, I mean, it'd be nice, for example, if Putin thought we're an IT firm. But, you know, basically, you know, if you know, one thing that happens is power corrupts. So in IT terms, you can't just have power. Original things, power has to, there's some intelligence behind it. Okay, power, ideally, there's a duty behind that power. And the way that I think they put it, everything comes out of love. If you got a certain amount of power, so you can have a love of power and be a, a sociopath, <laughs> narcissist, because you love yourself. But when we extend that out, remember, it stopped the two spheres. And instead of this, this the two, the yin, the yang, this starts to work together as parents to give birth to creation, talking with your IT. But if we can do that, it's a better world. And the hard thing is, yeah, we all gonna go, that would be nice, but, so we're, we're here to, to kind of start to get a foundation within ourselves for what that means. That's what the IT training, that's what the dojo is supposed to do, okay? Anyway, oh. <clears throat> okay, uh, what's your name? Huh? Hey. If there's up, there must be down. If there's down, there must be up. Tension. Now we're working with complex pattern. The right and left are representing the fire, water, water, fire, heaven, earth, earth, heaven. What's the difference between heaven, earth, and water, fire? Not much. The different ways of describing the world. Right. Right. Huh? Huh? In more motion, it kind of looks like this. Okay. So let's change partners. Can she now go?
Okay, what I think I kind of want you to do a little bit. It's just a little constant of it. We'll move a little bit. To, uh, just the phone goes. See, what's spirit? The spirit is, is the stage for women to start to do their dance. So my movement doesn't start with the hands, it starts with the body on this one. Uh, uh, if it was up, then let's be down. So if it was back, which is on the it must be front. Uh, uh, so then what you're doing, again, what is spirit? Spirit a lot of times is a stage for yin and yang to do their production. You see that feeling a little bit like that? Limited production. We don't make wild water here. <laughs> okay. You know, since a stage, it's a universe. Okay. The stage was the universe and what it happened to be right. Oh, yeah. oh, there. 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 Oh, Too small. The first movement that we do is with the water to save the hands up. They can't even get to heaven out there. A lot of this is my eyes too small. Huh? Yeah. Right here, I stop and I'll send it six or something. You know, so it's very important right like here. Huh? It's the first thing, the production. Huh? Don't give them much of a chance. You know? huh? Oh, my huh? oh, my Once I got the stage clear, you just let the dance happen. You don't think too much, okay? But it is important right here. What a crazy thing. Since I get my eye out of the way. That's a lot of it. The stage is too close, my eye is too tight. The two forces can't dance, okay? So yeah, part of it's learning how to be very easy with your eye. And one of the things here, for example, is this is sound of weakness, so right about here. 
I'm seeing the global situation, but I'm still paying attention to you. <laughs> you see that feeling? You don't want to be like, oh, God, I want to get away from this. No, I'm still paying attention to you, but I'm seeing the global situation. See that feeling? Now we can negotiate. <laughs> I'm not sure it's too crazy to do it. Let's take that place on the phone. It's not a matter right now. Okay? Let's just open a little bit. Yeah. I'm in that tunnel vision. I'm seeing the whole room. Oh, look at all this space here. I know you're afraid of NATO, but NATO doesn't want you to run everything. So, but why are you afraid of NATO? You're big, you're strong. Why are you so afraid of that you have to kind of do all this crazy stuff? You know, it goes down to fear and power. Yeah. Yeah. My first question is not with my hand. I'm opening. Okay. What is that doing? I'm clearing the stage for the forces to be able to create and dance. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's big on a glass too, eh? Yeah. Not much. Okay. Okay. Clear the stage. That's also the eyes and very easy. Okay, now. Okay, now what I'm going to do a little bit. I'm stepping right into her. I'm going to give her a better place to lie down. Okay. The first now your first place is there, but see I'm, I'm linearizing it right here. Circle. Okay. And then that motion. Right. You get your halfway there. Make the whole journey. Okay, to come in this way. Okay. <laughs> okay. okay. You wanna go well, circle? Circle line. Okay. Circle has this you know, yeah, 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 yeah. Huh? An opening motion. Yeah, if you watch a lot of those on this stuff, you see them this way. Oh, it's amazing that people say no. You understand? It's still contact, it's just energy to energy. All right, now there's also that sort of motion. It's a bit more early in, probably ITG just to. But if you go a little better, you know, well, if I go do the first part, well, then all of a sudden I start to linearize in here, it gets too awkward. Yeah. See, right here, I'm halfway there. So rotate the hips a little bit more. Give you a better yeah. place to land as opposed to smack fall. Yeah, it also felt like you had only the getting head as well. I mean, I, I mean, so you 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 need them all. I mean, basically, you know, your own, your 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 full body parts are more like they're, you know, they're the, you know they're both the performers and the stage crew, you know, on the stage. We got to clear out so we can do act two. Okay, in some cases, the first theater is probably the performers also the stage crew. <laughs> okay, so you got to do two things, right? And here, I mean, you know, for here, for 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 yin and yang, the fire water do that. Well, we got to move the props to this next scene. So now we got to shift the background. Okay, so sometimes you double up. We're a first theater, so 
the performers have to go out there and, you know, between the acts. But we're very clear. The stage manager is the performers. We don't confuse them. The forces are receptive positive. Clear the stage. Okay. I haven't cleared the stage. I left some junk on there from last two. Okay. So within that, you know, somebody gets confusion. So one of the things I want to look at is when I go this way, I I I have to this. Yeah. 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 Okay. There's a lot of lessons just in the movement. Because if you look at the movement, now the movement is about how T moves. And you can't understand T without understanding positive receptive with fire and water. You see what I mean? And so, you know, if you're going to sing, you're going to think of here, but think of your body, which is kind of your, yes. your guts and your heart, then is just having to clear the stage. That's the easy the eye. See the feeling right there? It's very easy. Okay. Okay. We're at that time. We are at that time. One of the things I, I, I kind of want to mention is that, you know, we all have roles to play. And um, a lot of clearing the eye or being easy the eye. It's clearing the stage. The eye is the clutter that gets in the way of spirit. And we were kind of playing, you know, the theater game because, you know, the stars are like yin and yang, the water fire. Okay. Uh, you can use, you know, a masculine feminine, but, but that there's nothing with gender. Okay. And so, you know, I kind of use the water fire. Or but it's almost like, you know, each throw is a different act in a play, and you have to clear from the previous app to do the act you're in. And a lot of what that is about is the eye being easy. I was watching the Dome Sensei show on uh, Friday, okay, and I had this sense, it was interesting, because, you know, the, the term is easy the eye. I've always had trouble with that because, you know, the eye is trying to get easy with itself. So what came up for me was self says to be easy. I, easy the eye, well, the eye is trying to be easy with itself. It's like I get grabbed and I'm trying to work something out there. Words from the truer sense of you, self, be easy. That's clearing the stage for the performers to come on. Yin to yang, fire to water, heaven to earth. And sometimes that's tricky because, you know, uh, we're poor theater, <laughs> which means that the performers have to do all the, the shifting between the acts. That does happen. Okay, but you can't get confused. Okay, we're clearing the stage. All of a sudden, then we're kind of the spirit of that space where the performers dance. Okay, so we're both. And most of the time, we're stagehands forgetting to memorize our lines and forgetting that we need to clear the stage out for the real production to happen, okay? And so if we kind of look at that, what is spirit? Well, spirit for me is, you know, when you can see the whole room, you know, your power. You can get very specific, seeing the whole room, you see pretty much everything. And you can hone in on that without losing the room. And when I'm in that space, then, then how he moves, is, is fairly obvious. If it goes down, it goes back up. If it goes up, it goes back down. If it goes right, it goes back left. Okay? It's not that hard. 
What's really hard is realizing I did in my own way by putting clutter on the stage. That's I. And ironically, I can create more clutter by getting too involved that, okay, I, I'm confused whether I'm a, I'm a stage manager or a performer. I gotta be both. You clear the stage so that the forces can dance for you and show that they get along, okay? And that's really what the whole thing is about as far as I can tell. You can get too good at, at doing stuff and all of a sudden you don't clear. If you don't clear, we're not doing those senses talking into because you know, it's the point where, you know, these two forces come here to create. So creation can happen through their harmony. Why do they hang out? Well, it all goes back to this force and that force. There's an attraction, there's a love that binds them. And um, what I could get excommunicated for this, but it was just his best student might have never put a Aikido D on, and that's Sadaharu O, the home run champion. He studied with our sensei, not so much Aikido, but you know, how the universe works and how to do that on, that, on baseball. And always quoted as saying, you know, all his stuff in baseball came down to one realization. 868 home runs, he didn't talk about that. He said, everything comes out of or comes to love. Why did the two even get on the same stage? So there's a possibility of a dance. There's an attraction there. And then I comes in and there's all, all of a sudden the stage gets too cluttered for that dance to happen. And so if we can start to, you know, in those sense words sometimes, he's talking about Japanese culture, you still be. No, it's just a, a constant clearing. Yeah. They're just going to get muddled. We're just going to have to, to clear of it. So the, the yin to the yang, the water to the side, the heaven to the earth, or whatever. But Izanagi to Izanami. They can dance together. So our work being, you know, okay, things like self, soul, spirit are very, very advanced terms. And what I'm talking about maybe is, you know, when I'm saying spirit, Spirit is, is, is really maybe more of an original self. It's open. It's all open. Your original forces binding together to that original attraction, which is love, create together. And that, I think, is what Osensei meant when he used the term I key. And so today we were kind of saying, well, if it goes this way, it's got to come back. If it goes this way, it has to go that way. If it goes out in a circle, it has to come back to the center. It goes back to the center, it's got to go back out in a circle. So, you know, that process of the energy moving in a way that does not oppose its other half, its complementary partner, to me is what I was saying meant. And what we can do is we can just get better at clearing the stage. That's too much eye activity. All right, so I forget to move something out of the next scene, it ruins the production. That's odd. And so it's constant. Yeah. Anyway, we're gonna go out. So, Okay, thank you very much. Okay, a couple of you are, you know, we're gonna do a uh, dinner for Harry Concepcion on Saturday. It's 5.30 at uh, Willow Street, Woodfair Pizza in Los Gatos. Okay, so, you know, uh, if you, I think most everybody 
is, is declared, but if you're going to come, uh, please email me and we'll get you put on a list because we have to have a rough idea of who's going to show. Okay. And um, I was thinking, you know, you know, basically, I know I'm talking to both of you, okay, uh, that, that the judge could, you know, you see, I, I would get a judge present. I would get an absolutely dead present. So if maybe the two of you could come up with, a, you know, an idea for a present cost limit to the dojo. If you can get it, then the dojo will reimburse you hundred dollar limit. But you know, a present for Harry Sensei from the dojo. Okay. So you want to talk among yourselves? Let me know what it is and how much it is. If you have a receipt, then I can cut you a check for it. So you know, it won't be anything out of pocket. But I would probably get a real Betty present. And so I think you have a much more of a sense for what he might like. Okay. All right. Well, thank you very much. Thank you.